what the subsequent years will bring if the agenda stays on track, in what Aldous Huxley characterizes as the final revolution, will be a technocratic, transhumanist apotheosis. Ushering in the emergence of a new order of species, reminiscent of the predictive programming revelation of the method, epitomized by 2001 Star Child and its many derivatives. Which in reality will not be the millennial dawning of a golden age for a crowned and conquering mankind but rather a descent into a dark age of tribulation for a new ontology of dehumanized servitude. As man and machine merge, in Schwab's biodigital convergence of Deschardins' Omega Point Singularity. Pictures from the tripods, an update of the classic H.G. Wells trope, portending to Elon Musk's Neuralink, authored by John Christopher, Rockefeller scholar. The aliens we are being prepared for, in the heavily promoted theory of panspermia, could possibly be a genetically engineered progeny of the elites who acknowledge the orbits they travel are so far removed from ordinary folk, they may as well be regarded as another species. The idea regarding the engineering of a master race, masquerading as a species of alien overlord, is implied in the BBC's treatment of the tripods. The series postulates that the masters, a genetically engineered species presented as extraterrestrials, who have enslaved humanity in a totalitarian, neo-feudalism, reducing them to a form of transhumanist subjugation via the cap, a projection of Elon Musk's Neuralink, are a creation of the Cognosks. Cognosk presumably derives etymologically from the word conoscenti, an implicit allusion to Gnosticism. They are conceived of as being some form of artificial intelligence, redolent of the projected post-humanist technology of the elite. This key element wasn't present in the books of John Christopher and is significant in its prominent inclusion to the BBC's interpretation. This sounds like the key to the mystery, that final layer of obfuscation which previously hid the powers and principalities is dissipating, in an unveiling of the hypostasis of the Archons, 